So I have a friend that's asked me to make some bottle openers out of this. It's an elephant head. Um, I've got some 1 16th inch steel here that I'm going to try and use. Uh, I'm going to cut out uh, 5 by 4 inch squares. Uh, put this down and try and cut the basic shape out of uh, off the bandsaw and then throw it in the forge and see if we can't make it work. All right, so I've been thinking about this. I was working on an elephant head uh, bottle opener for a friend of mine. I'm not too sure though that the sheet metal that I was using is going to be uh, capable enough. 
uh, whenever I was hand grinding it last night, uh, it was starting to bend and move a bit, and that's probably not the best thing. So I may be able to make some trinkets out of it or something, but for now, I'm not too certain that it's going to be a bottle opener. We'll see. So what I'm doing right now is just trying to refine the shape a little bit better. Get the nice openings in it and clean up any of the edges that need to be cleaned up. Um, because the spots are so tight, the only way I can really get in there is with uh, hand files. I can't get in there with a Dremel bit or anything. I can't use a grinder itself. So it's just time consuming, just have to do it this way. So I'm set it to time lapse and hopefully get this done here soon. All right, so I think that's pretty good. <clears throat> I'm going to try and straighten it up a little bit. Uh, the trunk is a bit warped. And then clean it up on the wire brush over there and try and polish it up a bit. And we'll see how it works. All right, so what I found out actually is that this might actually be thick enough. Um, but the problem is, is that this little clip that catches the bottle cap uh, needs to be recessed a little bit. So we're gonna go try and work on that. Maybe we can bend it down just a little bit so where it catches the bottle cap and then you can pry it open. I don't know, we'll see. We might have to go with a different design. If so, then that'll be another video, but definitely give it a shot, we'll see. All right, so the problem is, is that I don't really have any tool that I can use to bend this down any. So what I'm gonna try and do is use a nail header that I made out of a railroad spike a while back and see if I can't bend this ear piece down and then switch it over and we're gonna try and put a little curve here and recess this bit. That way it'll catch a hold of a lid. All right, so literally my concern is, is that when I go to pry this, the metal, the sheet metal that I used to cut this shape out of is too thin and it's just gonna bend and not actually open the bottle, but we'll see. It worked pretty well. Maybe need to refine the shape a little bit. Maybe close this section up just a tad so there's a bit more structure for this ear. Um, and find a way to bend this properly down so it looks a bit more even and not messed up. But this is the first iteration. It was just a test to see if I could even do it to start with. So it's turned out pretty well. I like it. I'm, I'm pretty happy with it. Uh, there is a bit more refining that I could do and will do in coming videos, but yeah, thank you for watching.